keep up to date with our latest videos, please hit the subscribe button below. Hi there, welcome to this video from racingbackdata.com. Uh, in this video, I'm going to be showing you the horse history stroke head to head function that we've uh, improved on the website. Uh, we're going to navigate to it from the uh, from the home page. Now, the improvements we've made here, it's a lot easier to select the horses and generate your output. Uh, and this can be used if you just want to see the output of one horse, i.e. You, you want to see its full history. Um, or if you want to compare two horses in races that they've raced against each other in. So you can see here that we've got horse one, horse two option. I'm going to select horse one and we're going to look for Honeysuckle, who's flavor of the month at the moment. So simply click the letter that the horse begins with uh, and you'll see that that will populate uh, next to the horse one icon. Uh, take a couple of seconds. And as soon as it's done that, we can select the horse. There you go. So you've got H. We can select the horse from the drop down. So click in the drop down and simply start typing the name of the horse and it will populate and we can either send that straight to Excel. So if you wanted the full output for the horse in Excel, or we can send it to screen like I'm going to do now. And just to get that horse's history, we leave the horse two option blank. And this horse history will generate on screen. And you can, I think you'll see from the output that this horse is yet to be beaten. So you could further, you could still do have the option to further send that to Excel now, if you would like. Um, but there's the full horse history for Honeysuckle. You can see that every single race is placed one. Uh, so it's profit and loss by backing at Betfair, uh, backing at Industry SP each way, uh, and also its lay returns. And that's then summarized in this table on the left-hand side here. Um, now there's nothing on the right-hand side because we haven't compared Honeysuckle to any other horse, um, but we're gonna do a comparison here. And I think one of the classics was Kato Star and Denman. So let's use those two horses. They tangled sort of around 2009, 2000 through to 2011. Off the top of my head, we'll soon find out. So I've selected K and then I'm gonna type in Koto Star. And then in this example, we wanna select a second horse. So I'm gonna select D for Denman. So you've, I've clicked that. It just does take a second or two just to populate. Um, you don't need to keep clicking. You'll see there that D's populated and we can type in Denman. You can also use the scroll if, if you'd rather, but typing just brings the horse to the screen quicker. And we click get history. Now what this will do, will output all the races where those two raced uh, in the same race. So there's four, as you can see there in total, um, and they, they won one apiece, uh, and Denman had three seconds to Carto's uh, one second. And then you've got the summary if you've backed them in those races um, to, to industry and Betfair and also laying as well. Um, and that's really how you get the uh, the full output. If you wanted to look at Colto's full output from there, you could either remove Denman. So we can go to the top here and select none or and then click get history or you can select Colto here from the drop down and that brings up his full history. So regardless of whether it's racing against Denman or not. So that's how you use the horse history head-to-head -head function.